are the folks who are driving the innovation. Um, when I look around this room, uh, I see the proof of American ingenuity at work, scientists, engineers, entrepreneurs coming together to tackle these really important challenges. I think we are going to change the way we consume energy in this country faster in the next five years than we've seen in the last 30. And it's all because of the innovation in this room that this continues moving forward and continues to create the jobs of tomorrow that we are really relying on as policymakers and as a country. These are, these are national companies that are leading the conversation around the future of energy and how we can continue to promote reliable and affordable and clean and uh, doing, doing it the, the right way. So the National Electrical Manufacturers Association is a trade association representing 400 electrical manufacturers. So everything from uh, the time electricity is generated uh, throughout the electric grid, uh, even down to the end use. So we would love to see the House and the Senate come together and pass a comprehensive energy legislation um, that promotes energy efficiency in buildings and also a strong, resilient electric grid that can integrate more renewable energy. ASHRAE is a building technology society. We've been around for about 121 years. Uh, members, about 56,000 members in the heating, ventilation, air conditioning, and refrigerating space. Uh, yeah, the expo is great. Been attending it for a number of years. Find that it's a, a great networking event. Have a lot of great speakers and uh, policy sessions. So ASHRAE, as a building technology society, is really all about making sure that federal policy reflects the best technical information that is available. So the types of policies that we're focused on are those that involve heating, ventilation, air conditioning, and refrigerating, and the allied uh, trade and industries. The organization was founded in, 19, in 2007 to promote mechanical insulation in the United States and Canada. And our objective is education. We are in our fourth opportunity with house bills to promote mechanical insulation. And we would very much like to see Congress pass those. They're nonpartisan bills to promote mechanical insulation. Philips Lighting specifically is the global leader in lighting solutions. So we've been in the business over 100 years, about 120 years or so. Um, we're one of the uh, founders of the lighting industry. I think Philips is concerned with bringing a, a, a broader dialogue that encompasses the not only the traditional lighting savings, which we get from energy efficiency, LED technologies, but we'd also see more of an implementation across the holistic offering for lighting. So for example, a rec uh, recognizing that lighting brings simply more than just energy efficiency. Uh, efficiency, but I think you'll see that lighting also brings things like performance and um, additional functionality beyond the traditional energy proposition.